And to enjoy that beautiful weather on Thursday in the ocean, think again. Part of the beach is off limits in Virginia Beach tonight. The health department issued a swimming advisory this afternoon. And 10 on your side's Liz Kilmer has been working to learn more. She joins us now from 8th Street. And Liz, talk about bad timing. Yeah, Anita, tomorrow the surf competition starts for the big East Coast Surfing Championship. That will be over on 2nd Street. Right now we're here on 8th, and from here to 22nd, folks are seeing these warning signs, uh, which mean you can't swim until health officials give the go-ahead. Abandoned water, but not due to lack of interest. The same week that hundreds of surfing competitors have come to the ocean front to jump in and ride a wave, there's a big problem. We were swimming, and then we heard him whistle, and he motioned for everybody to get out from his stand down the beach. And so everybody got out. Orders from the Department of Public Health, spanning 14 blocks at the ocean front, because bacteria levels right now exceed state standards. Yeah, it really sucks. Took a week off vacation, off of work on vacation. From 8th Street to 22nd, these warning signs prohibiting folks from swimming are seen at entrances. Uh, we snuck away for a few days, so we'd love to be able to get in the water. According to health officials, the bacteria detected won't make you sick, but when it's present, experts believe the risky germs may be nearby. Some folks we talked to weren't concerned. No. Nah. <laughs> and braved the water just outside of the perimeter near 7th Street. He signaled that we were able to swim from the green swim flag. from the green flag oh, all yeah. the way down. From Which the we beach. did. We all got back in the water and it was fine. Others, like Melissa Patterson, weren't so sure. I don't know. It looks like the current in the water is kind of going that way, so whatever it is is probably going that way. <laughs> she hopes to get the all clear everywhere and soon. And this week she's far from alone. And back live, health officials will continue testing the water until it's okay, at which point these signs will be removed. Now, the last time we reported on a swimming advisory here at the ocean front, well, that was about two years ago. We're told right now there are no changes, nothing's being affected with the surf uh, competition, but of course we'll keep you posted on all of that. Anita, back to you.